briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1968, the North Dakota Supreme Court heard the case of Keller v. Keller, which focused on the court's power to issue temporary orders in cases of separation from bed and board. The temporary orders in question could include support and maintenance, restraining orders, and enjoining a spouse from interfering with the other spouse or children. The appellate court also had the power to revise these orders. In this case, the plaintiff filed for separation and obtained a temporary order for support, which also barred the defendant from interfering with the plaintiff and their children. The defendant appealed and requested a stay on the portion requiring him to leave the home, which was granted after filing a stay bond. The plaintiff then moved to dismiss the appeal, arguing that the order was not appealable. With allegations of mistreatment and abuse by the defendant, the court held that the temporary order requiring the defendant to leave the shared home was properly granted, based on specific allegations of violence and threats. It was determined that the trial court did not abuse its discretion in issuing the temporary order, and a stay was not automatically required. Instead, the court used its discretion to decide whether to stay the order pending appeal. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.